All right, guys, welcome to part, I think it's now 20 of my playthrough of Cyberpunk 2077. And I am the Guy Knight. We are about to meet with Takimura. But first, taxi. Well, that was kind of lame, but never mind that. We are waiting for our car that I called. It appears if you press and hold the V key, you actually, it actually lets you know or lets you choose. Lock it. Lock it. All right. Can I get in? Nope. All right. Let me try to call it one more time. Maybe it's fine. Or I just get this guy's car. There's nobody there. All right. That's also fine. It's all right, guys. It's all right. Hey, I don't think I know you. I'm Claire. Might not remember me. Bartender at the Afterlife. Uh oh. Forgot to close my tab. Bar has a buzz about you lately. As the merc who's reliable gets things done. And since I need help. Okay. Need a driver for street races. Drop by my auto shop. I'll tell you more. Your garage, where is it? In Arroyo, on Valley. Lovely spot, you can't miss it. Alright, I'll try not to. If I'm not there when you arrive, just hang. I'll show up after my shift at the after. Okay, see you, Claire. Hmm. Three places. What can go wrong? I'm so good at driving. If you have seen any of my previous, like, driving footage, you already know that. You already know that. My mastery. My driving mastery. Level 1. Or 0 0.5. But it's alright. Just a game. Still we do slight left -way. By the way, I'm experimenting with a wider field of view, so let me see how my frame rate also goes. Um, if it's okay, I'll continue using that because I kind of like like wider uh, field of view. But if it's too bad, I will switch to 90 degrees. Right now it's at maximum, it's 100 degrees. And I kind of like to see like more of the city. But hey, there you go, my driver, driving skills, max level. Watch out for your back, alright, right. we are watching our back, guys. There it is. Not our front, and we just missed it there. Can I just like, continue? Yes, I can. Navigation is awesome. A big building. Dear Night City visitors, on your left you see the K2, the tower of the K2 Donuts that became very popular in 2065. The first K2 Donut was actually called K1 Donut. And it was eaten by George McDonald. That's all there is. There is no more. Then they proved the recipe after this guy recovered from allergic reaction. And now they're called K2 Donuts. And I missed my turn. Of course I did. Of course I did. Never mind that. We're going back. We are going back. Heaps of trash there. Like, it's okay. It's okay. Hmm. Japan Town, Town Docks. Here somewhere, guys, we will see the Kimura. 
for the... I can wait here. Ah, water. Water. Sometimes it's good to see you, V. Seems pretty, uh, secluded here. It is appropriate for such a secret meeting. What the hell happened? You look close to awful. You see a man robbed of his implants, money, and dignity. Look well. It is not all bad. I am mostly unnoticed in the streets. Friend you mentioned here? Oda? He should be here any moment now. Willing finally to give me the spec on him? He's Hanako-sama's bodyguard. Hanako Arasaka's? From the carrier at anchor in the bay? Saburo's daughter? Yes, and if he believes you, we'll next meet with her. True, you can trust him, or he'll sell our assets at... Well, let's just give him the benefit of a doubt. Sure you can trust him? Yes. Convincing. Very. I have nothing to lose. Is that better? Worse. Because I got plenty to lose. By car, huh? A good sign. He is usually camouflaged. Is he gonna teleport over here? Don't do it, man. Or... Okay, it's a man. Don't do it. Don't teleport. Just walk. Walk. Like no moment. There you go. Takemura-san. Oda. Is this him? Your thief. He's my witness. B. Can't speak for myself, you know. So speak. I have been told you know things. Of course I know things. Why wouldn't I know? Yoronobu strangled his father. Not gonna like what I have to say. Well, let's just go Who's there. Saw what happened. Yoronobu strangled the old guy. Silence! Not one word more. You will bring death to your door. But it is the truth. Hanako-sama must hear it. My one concern is to keep her safe in this city forgotten by the gods. Is she in danger? Now? No. Yet during the parade to honor Arasaka-sama, most certainly, I bring you this witness to his murder. And you dare to worry about a silly parade? Fool! Correct. Unlike you, I have not yet failed to keep my oath. But you can't ignore the truth. You will regret those words. The only thing I regret is that I came here to meet you. There is a price on your head. I do you a favor now by not cutting it off and taking it straight to your Inabu Sama. What would you do now were you in my place? I do no favors. I would deliver you ahead to Yorinobu-sama. Consider yourself lucky that I am not you. Oda, you... Not like we're asking for a whole lot here. Just one brief meeting. Hanako should decide if what we say is true. You can't decide for her. Will you help? I will not. But I will let you leave this place, this city, unharmed. If I see either of you again, I will not be so lenient. Should I just kill this guy now? Be very careful, my friend. Should I? We are all so far from home. Oh, I can't. I can't, guys. Come on, Takimura. Good fucking you do? Don't teleport. One hour soccer whack job is already plenty. No way this is gonna work. Mm, yet. We walk away with a small measure of success. Hmm. How do you figure that? What Oda said. 
they return to Tokyo after the parade. Do you not see the parade? It is our chance, perhaps, if somehow we can get to Hanako-sama. We must do a proper reconnaissance first. We'll need a precise map of Japan town. Hold on. It is your turn to call on friends. Do you know a fixer who could help? Uh, hang on. Not so fast. It could sound as easy as hacking a schism. You said yourself, Hanako's got the tightest security in all Night City. Correct. That is why I wish for you to contact us with the local fixer. No, just the fixer dame. Wakaku Akata. Runs a pachinko parlor on Jig Jig Street. We must pay this woman a visit. Jig Jig Street, guys, this is where things are going down. Will you join me? Well, sure. Why not? Let's go to Wakaku Okada. Itadakimas. Uh, I mean, Itarashai, guys. Itarashai. I like here. He's driving with 20, 120 kilometers per hour already. Like, why not? Jinji Street. What is this name? <laughs> Just a night city name. Beware. You mock me too often. Uh, now it works. Now it works. The speedometer. I real what's going on at Arasaka. Any idea what's going on at Arasaka? Tell me, man. Tell Only me. what I can surmise from what I see on TV. Yorino and his puppets grin at the cameras and insist that everything is under control. But the wider the smile, the bigger the lies. Is you true. right, Goro? Yes. Why the sudden concern? Just asking something wrong with that. We have shared interests, you and I. Have shared interests, you and I. Where have you forgotten? Certainly not. Good. Because catching lead in Night City is easier than catching a cold. And I need you alive. I am alive and well, as you can see. You should worry about yourself. <laughs> this guy. Alright guys, let's just skip the rest of this ride. In Night City. By the way, my loading times may be a little bit slow because I didn't have enough, time, enough space in my... Uh, solid state drive so I had to put it on my hard drive with the solid state drive it will probably run much smoother from the loading times at least awesome Let's go to Jig Jig Street once more. Now, I may not be good with names, but I do have quite a what talent for faces. Face? Where have I seen yours before? On the TV? Very unlike. Rogue, my sweet. This has got to be a misunderstanding. I've no idea who jumped your team, but the claws? No, never. My boys know their place. I, I, I'm sorry, got to go. I have guests. V, so nice to see you. And your charming friend is? Happen to be working together. That's all. Takemura Goro desu. Okada-san, oai dekite kohei desu. Ah. A true gentleman. Ah, oh, shame only that he's being hunted by all Arasaka's tin soldiers. And you, V, bring him to my door. Give me one reason why I shouldn't notify the proper authorities right away. Eddie's is why. Always about Eddie's, Wakako. You want to make him? We got biz. 
Doesn't get any simpler. So tell me, and mark well I still have my phone at hand. Need intel on the parade that's scheduled to come through Japantown. So it's Arasaka. Again. What I fail to understand is... Why come to me? Did Mr. Deshawn not come to the phone? Goro, remind me why Dex's fat, backstabbing ass is currently indisposed. He is deceased. Butchered and dumped in a landfill by some Arasaka goon. Real shame that. That a threat I detect? No threat, no. Asked why I couldn't reach Dex, I answered. Just facts, nothing more. Good, cause you would then have to join him. Okada-san, our intentions are honorable. We need just information. It is a matter of life and death. Everything's on the shards. How much does this cost? My pockets are empty. Clearly. My gift to you, it's free. Okada-san, what is free often proves most costly. Gonna take them or not? Japan Town. Whole district is to be sealed off for the parade. Dashi platforms, the main attraction. They'll fly this way, high above street level. Along the parade route, balconies, footbridges, and vantage points affording good views. Hanako Arasaka, a guest of honor, will deliver her speech from the largest float. She'll do this exactly here. Got no idea about security, but given recent events, expect it to be tight. Our last parade? Arasaka undercovers infiltrated the crowd. Not to mention a smattering of sharpshooters, drones. And if that's not enough fun for one day, a net runner, one at least. They use the city CCTV to observe everything. Main access point, here. It's an old, automated control center. If you ask me, most useful by far. At the end, the floats will float out of Japantown, and we'll be left with trash up to our elbows that no one will collect. That's it. It's all I have. It must be enough. Then go. Be on your way. Not at all curious what we're going to all this trouble for. Blissful ignorance has served me well. In any case, I'll find out soon, won't I? Thanks, Wukako. We appreciate this, Okada-san. What is this, guys? What is this? I'm kind of mesmerized. It's just ads. Awesome. Let's go. Takemura san. A delightful, mature woman. This information, it could be just what we need. But I will try to investigate further. I will stay here some time and call some associates. The moment I learn something new, I will let you know. Just low profile, okay? Don't start handing out autographs. In fame, I could not overtake you if I tried. Be safe, B. Awesome. It's time for the afterlife, guys. Afterlife. I wonder how... Yeah, how this girl, the friend of John is gonna react when she sees that he is actually alive. 
What was uh, her name again? I don't remember. Never mind. We're gonna find out. What's happening? Why are they? Why are they I'm not gonna come here again. Unless I have to. Which probably is gonna happen though. Where is my car? Dude, where is my car? Oh, it's over there. It's over there. The irony. The irony, guys. Being hit and run over by my own car. Just running down the streets with an aftermath. Well, I could probably try to use some of those fast travel thingy but they find it like nicer to just like run the streets maybe get some practice for those street races that are happening at one point There is a new car. Right. Nice. I'm not sure if I want to buy a new car yet. Judging by how well I treat my old one. Police introduction. What? Any legal activities such as death or attacking civil citizens? What? Did they? What? Did I didn't even touch. Never mind. I didn't even touch her. Like, I literally did not touch her. She just somehow died. I don't know. Anyhow. Who's gonna know? What's up Get to work, you lazy photos! Hey, look! What, huh? Would you look at that? What the you see it too, me? right? You've either gone completely whacked or I'm having a mystical moment. What's that chick's name? The one with the hair? Fucking hell! Misty? Yeah, more likely a neuron misfire for Victor to check out. Or maybe I ask them both. Spare change? What? The trash destro destroyer. Welcome to Afterlife, guys. All right, talk to Misty, talk to Victor, what optional, now? find all the crimes we're putting in the city. Bodies inside. Afterlife's all about breath, the respect you command. How's things? Oh, wait. A rogue, rogue, yes, rogue. That's what's your name. Probably Hang on just a little longer, too. Ripper's on the way. Oh, fuck! Rotten luck. Why aren't we at the hospital? I don't know. I have no idea us. why aren't you at the hospital. Uh, what hey, I'm interested hey. is like, is there it's like clear, a new... Right? Gotta get going. New you cocktail come, come named come our, after our friend. So where were we? Clear, right? You come to talk about my offer? Yeah, let's talk street racing. Sure. But not here, it's mayhem. I'll be at my garage after my shift. Swing by? Nova, talk there. Have a good one. What's that in her finger? Is she hurt, guys? Hey, lover boy, you're spilling. Yeah, no. Is that Victor? Is trouble? The net around me? No, I'm standing here. Everything. Let me be plain. See? Again. Hello? I'm not Solve your own problems. Clean up your own level. shit. Go fuck yourself. Wait for Rob to finish her conversation. Hey, interested in some work? Rogue. Wanted to talk. 
It's okay. Hmm. Not here, not there. Who are you? Name's V. And what is it you want, V? All these years, it's really her. Fucking bro, just kicking it back on a couch at the afterlife. <laughs> Don't mess with her, she's got MRIs. See right through you. Give her the truth. Need your services. Gotta track a guy down. Mm-hmm. Anders Hellman. Hotshot engineer. Worked for Arasaka. Millisec. Anders Hellman. Pinpoint him for me? Huh. <laughs> Thanks. Jump in too soon. First, my help's got a price. Second and third, Dexter Deshawn, Jackie Wells, T-Bug. Multiple bells ringing, V. Left a lot of bodies behind. Death walks in your wake. Chalk that up to bad luck? There's the bitch I know. Ask her about Sokka Tower. How they shot me up right in front of her. Wanna go through obits? Really? Fine. Johnny Silverhand. Zeroed inside our socket tower. Before your very eyes. Got more if you want. Or we could just talk. Got balls on you, boy. Don't like that on everybody, but they seem to suit you. Anyways, feelings be damned, I've always said. This is pure biz. You need my help, so get those eddies ready. Mm-hmm. See? Should be enough. Mm-hmm. Come back tomorrow. We'll talk. Oh, guys, I was rich. I had like over 60,000. Didn't even notice. I'm gonna just chill out here. For a day. That's how life goes on, guys. One day at the bar. I didn't even get to meet that Mosby. Hey, interested in some work? Here to see Rogue, expecting me. Of course, she didn't move, like as well. Let me see if she ah, cannot even jump. Anyhow. Hey, Rogue, I'm back. What about Hellman? Two, please. Mm -hmm. Make some room. Sit down. Hope you found him. Don't see that often, determination like yours. Must really need this guy. Matter of life and death. <laughs> Haven't heard that for a while either. Bottle stays. Go ahead. Enjoy. To your health. To yours, kid. Gonna need it. Thanks, Nix. Queen of the afterlife. Who would have thunk? Got a shard for you. Intel. Interesting stuff. Think she'll help? The rogue I remember was one cold-ass bitch. But she usually went with her gut. Something tells me she thinks you check out. Let's see what you got. Your helmet's not on any payroll, not officially anyway. But he does pop up in GNT's confidential stacks. It's a Kang Tao subsidiary, Chinese Corp. Kang Tao's been using them as a fig leaf for years. They're masked for more sensitive operations. All that clear? Probably keeping him hidden from Arasaka. Must have worked on a top secret project. Mm-hmm. Hidden from Arasaka or any other megacorp that wants what he knows. Decrypted map of upcoming Kang Tao convoy routes. Think Hellman might be in one of them? Thing is, which one? Take a look at the specs on this one. A lone AV, no ground support, no linked cargo manifests either. Weird. Sure, Kang Tao sometimes transports stuff unregistered if they want to push it under the table. But catch the load on this AV. Already approved in the system, but too low. So definitely no cargo on board. Huh. But there's a passenger list. Kang Tao security detail plus one VIP. 
Transfer from Chan T. Our boy Hellman. That was the good news. There it is. Data's all confidential. You just snap your fingers and it falls in your lap. I know where to look, and I know whose head to put in a vice. Also, hate wasting time, especially answering stupid questions. So what's the bad news? Bad news is the extraction site. Look, Night City airspace. All this. Mm-hmm. No way to jack the transport without the NCPD picking up on it. And here, we're too close to Kang Tao. We even give that AV a dirty look, their backup hustle will be on us. But, right here's Jackson Plains. Narrow corridor, just outside the city, and just out of Kang Tao's reach. Guess it's your lucky day. A dead zone. I'll grab him there. Gonna need a native to the area. Someone who'll set up the op, cobble together the gear. Even tracking that AV will be a bitch. Familiar with the type. Saw legacy models flying around during the war. They're mammoth, but they're quick. Plus they pack next-gen defenses. Can't take pot shots at it. Not even with serious firepower. Just won't work. It's not about firepower. There are ways, and people who know them. Or who can at least improvise on a theme. So a native. Know any hick mercs? Just one. Pan Am Palmer. She can't count on her clan anymore, but she's a true nomad. She knows those lands. And she will help you. Won't have a choice. Won't have a choice? Does not sound enticing. Not for her, not for me. Enticing comes at a price you can't possibly afford. Can't possibly afford to blow this chance at Navin Hellman. Your operation, your call. Got a bad feeling, V. Hmm. Can't be trusted if her clan banished her. Sorry, just not willing to pay you for help like that. Actually, she walked away. Said it was about the family, its future, nomad ideals, blah 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 blah. I stopped listening a few words in. Thought you preferred to know who you're dealing with. I know enough. Besides, when someone starts spouting ideals, it's probably about something else. Power, usually. Fortunately, not my biz, not yours. Pan Am's capable and stands to help you. That's all you need to know. Why's Pan Am gotta help me? I sense a catch. Pretty big one. Occasionally, Pan Am moves merch for me. Last job? Well, wasn't a good day for her. She run into a hitch? Complete bust, actually. Lost the goods and her ride. Pan Am will do anything to get the load back. Means her dignity. I know her. Okay. Guess I can try to help her. But if we don't know where to look, I mean... We do. I do. You know, but wouldn't tell Pan Am. Aim to play cat and mouse with me too? My aim is to know an opportunity when I see one, and then to seize it. Say I told her everything. What do you think she'd have done? Grabbed her iron and gone on the warpath, that's what. Not hard to see how that could have ended. And there's nothing I hate more than losing good people to plain stupidity. Huh. I'm her only chance, and she's my only chance. Two pawns on Rogue's board. You're quick. For a pawn. <laughs> no, V. Oh, V. Yeah. Fine. Let me hear what you know. Rocky Ridge, ghost town just outside Night City. Pan Am knows where. You'll go there, get the merch back. Wheels, too. Naturally, you'll call her first, sending you her deeds. Ah, oh, finally. Let's get All out clear. of here. Thanks. Good luck. I am Pawner. New contact added. Both Pawner. That's the best introduction ever. I'm gonna puke. Hello. Hey, V. Claire, this Pan Am? You come to talk about v my here. offer? V who? V hey, where? What gives? How did you even get this number? From Rogue. Ah, oh, great. Fuck. Where's that old warhorse want to kick me now? Is 
This thing between you and Rogue, couldn't care less. Got a job for you. Good, but I'm overextended at the moment. With the merch and your car, getting them back, I can help with that. The rail freight yard on Benita Street, the one hugging the city line. We'll meet there. See ya. Two point seven kilometers, of course. All right, guys, uh, this is it for this episode. I hope you enjoyed it. And if you did, give me a thumbs up. And uh, also, you could subscribe to my channel to view more awesome content. Like, why don't you one. control yourself? Just what I oh fucking God. need. Run. Why are they running? Why are they always running? This is crazy. I just bump into them and they, they disappear. Anyhow, guys, have a nice evening. Have a good day or have a good morning. Bye bye.